टाइम वेर द कंट्री इज हाई विद कोविड द मुंबई मेट्रो इज मेकिंग हेडलाइट द एम एम आर डी एज मेड सक्सेसफुल ट्रायल रन ऑन ट्वेंटी किलोमीटर ट्रैक एट वन गो द हाइएस्ट नंबर एवर अचीव एनी वेयर इन इंडिया सिटीज ओनली बी एम एल रेक रिसीव सो फार क्रॉल ऑन द वायरक्ट ऑन लाइन टू ए एंड सेवन एट अ कंसिडरेबल स्पीड At 7 a.m. in the morning, the train was taken out of the Charkhop depot and then to Akurli metro station of Line 7 via Dahisar. There, a ceremony was organized where the Maharashtra CM flagged off the train towards RA metro station. The train came back to Charkhop depot later in the evening. Amidst such a condition of COVID-19 and strict lockdown in Mumbai, Twitter raised questions on how the Maharashtra government could allow such an event where social distancing was broken live on camera. But never mind. MMRDA seems to be consistent in running the trains, as the trains were found again running on the tracks the next morning. So what's next? The only train that BEML has supplied so far will be rigorously tested on the 19km main line between the Hanu Karwari and Ari. Only one track has been tested so far. Which works of the other track is left to be completed. As the other track is commissioned, bi-directional operations will be simulated. during tests and trials at the same time stations will be completed signaling system will be tested and platform screen doors will be checked simultaneously sometime later as more train sets are received two or more trains will be operated at the same time once everything is completed simulation trials will be done and commissioner of metro railway safety clearance will be sought the commercial operations then can start by october but things won't be that easy Although Charkhop depot is enough to run services now soon it will be saturated as the system will expand in future a depot for red line was planned at Dahisar but trapped by a court stay order the land MMRDA wanted at Dahisar belongs to Airport Authority of India so an alternative land was proposed to Airport Authority of India so that the utilities can be shifted however the high court issued a stay order on the alternative land this has so far made the expansion uncertain But if MMRDA manages to acquire land at Bhayandar to build a depot then the problem can be solved. On the other hand situation is no better with RA depot of line 3. The fight between RA and Kanjur Marg sustains and a new step of MMRDA comes as an add on to make things even worse. Metro's Mogharpada depot that was going to serve three metro lines in future has been reported to be cancelled. MMRDA recently cancelled the tender and displayed no official reason for the same. With all these problems summed up, it's better to keep your fingers crossed. Opening of line 3 and few other lines of Western Mumbai doesn't seem to be possible in upcoming couple of years even though there are no problems with the construction of viaduct and procurement of rolling stocks and other systems. The next achievable target is the big loop of metro tracks around Kandivali and Borivali joining Metro 1 Andheri and Dhyan Nagar. For more subscribe to our channel Metro Rail Blog and have a nice day.